Hello and welcome to the Paris and Tushy Show. We will be talking about the fantastic art of Frida Kahlo today and was she not celebrated as much as she should? The woman died a tragic death and we will be talking about her with one of her daughters. And we will be investigating why High School Musical is such a big hit with children these days. Then we will talk, be talking about the strange old laws of England. Why did Tony Blair change these and do you think these were better? And you could win a free mouse and mouse bat map just by calling in. I was my <laughs> Hello and welcome back. And here we have Mel Carlo, Frida Carlo's daughter. Now, Mel, tell us about how you feel about your mother's art and seeing photos of her. Well, it makes me very, very sad because I miss her very much. But it makes me angry that she didn't think about me in these pictures. I was not there. She did not like me, I think. But I do not know. Uh, what else would you like to know? Please, I, I'm depressed. <laughs> She died in 1954. It really upset me as well. This is why I wear black. Because I feel that this is how I honour her. Even though she didn't like me. It says here, in the back of her autobiography slash picture thing. I will always love my daughter Mel. And I wish her to keep herself covered in dark clothing to hide herself <gasps> from prying men i did not see this ever before oh, i am no. so happy and this is a scotia i brought with me but this is my mother did this for of me when i was a baby it is very beautiful i have black hair but i'm not to show to anyone it's so sad. So, you sit here and you come on our chat room and you say you can't bear to see pictures of your mother. But I have to leave now. I have to see my boyfriend. How can you have a boyfriend with your mama? Dead! But he, he, he is her sister's brother. Her <laughs> sister's brother? Brother. My cousin. <laughs> That's your uncle. No, it's my cousin. It's long, long story. But I go out of my cousin now. He's so sweet and he's very attractive. <laughs> Please, I must go now. Please, let me go. Tushy and Paris show sponsored by Johnson's Baby Lotion. Hi, and next we have some um, kids um, saying their points of view or on High School Musical. <laughs> and welcome, Jamie. So, Jamie, what do you think of High School Musical? I think that High School Musical is really bad and stuff because they're like overdoing everything and they're saying, "Oh yeah, we're so happy," and they start singing, yeah. And I just think it's really crap. And also the skaters, they're just like, oh yeah, I can sing. It's like nothing, none of that would ever happen. And also, I don't like the fact that it's like for little kids and then all these teenagers, they start watching it, yeah? Because like, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm 16 and then I'd never watch that with all my mates, but not like my cool ones, like all the like chavs and stuff, they're loving it. It's crap. Okay. Um, and now, um... Also, what, um, if you had to pick a character out of High School Musical, who would you, ha if you have to, had to pick, would be the best actress and what actor? Well, I'd probably say I'd like to be Vanessa and Hudgens, yeah, because, you know, I've always wanted to be a lady. 
Okay. Do you do you think she's quite attractive? Yeah. Okay. Um, and um, so we'll be um hearing some more points of views from other children a bit later. Now we have Alicia. She's aged twelve, and she completely disagrees with Jamie. What do you have to say, Alicia? Well, you know, I really love High School Musical because, well, there's not much to say about it. I mean, it's funny, it's fun, and Zac Efron's really cute. You know. <laughs> and also, it's amazing songs, and they're really, really good singing. And I'm so going to buy Vanessa Ann Hudgens' album and um, Ashley Tisdale, who plays Sharpe. Oh, right. Well, I think um, um, Ashley isn't that good. <gasps> oh, my God, she's so good. She's such a good singer. But it's have you noticed the they have... I can... um, sorry, um, don't you think they have a, a kind of a fake voice? No, because she sings beautifully in tune, and she's, and she's really cool. Yeah, uh, I guess. <laughs> she's she's well, th she's quite good actually. But um, I I like the kind of feel of it, you know, all the um kind of um like the chavs and the um uh, the skateboard people come together. They don't have chavs in America. Well, I mean, you, you, you get what yeah. I mean. So, um, I've seen the film 12 times. Oh, wow. That's so, quite a lot. Look, my mum, she bought me the DVD. It's so good. Woo! Go! High School Musical. Wow, gets everywhere. Wave your hands up in the air. Woo! Rock okay, on! Okay, thanks a lot. Hello, and now we'll be talking about The Strange Laws of Old England, a book by Nigel Cawthorn. Now, Nigel is down on the line, so Nigel, what do you think of these laws? And do you think Tony Blair is better or worse at laying down the law than these old folk from the medieval well, time? Well, I think he is appalling. He doesn't respect the law and he's rude to everyone. He only wants to be um, the Prime Minister because he gets money. So, um, <clears throat> that's what I think. And I don't think he should be in charge of all of us. For example, the bins and everything are just unrespectable. Now, Paris, don't we have another person to debate against, Nigel? Um, yes, we have Lorraine from Sweden. So, Lorraine, what do you think well, about Well, you know, book? being living in Sweden and stuff, I often look at England, seen as we Swedes don't have much news. <laughs> oh yes, that is something That's to laugh very at. Very funny. I find it quite. <laughs> I find it offensive. <laughs> oh, can you please stop? You're true charm, Larry. Okay, thank you. <laughs> anyway, I think that Tony Blair oh, you is crack. actually yes. a pretty good prime minister. Stop it! Stop it! Tony Blair is a pretty. I'm just going to talk about you. Oh, that's Tony Blair great. is a pretty good prime good minister. Night, Tom, I think that he's Bye. much better than the old. England, seen as we Swedes don't have much news. Oh yes, that is something to laugh at, but I, I find it quite, I find it offensive. Can you please stop? Okay, thank you. Anyway, I think that Tony Blair is actually a pretty good Prime Minister. Stop it! Stop it! Tony Blair is a pretty, I'm just going to talk over you. Tony Blair is a pretty good Prime Minister and I think that he's much better than the old.